Good afternoon. Yeah, I learned something over the last three days. Nobody knows where San Jose is. Fascinating intel. Uh, as Brad mentioned, we are in the heart of Silicon Valley. Um, if you talk to our families, they might not say that they are at the heart of Silicon Valley, that participation is not equal, um, that some of our families drive to San, uh, Silicon Valley. We'd like to make sure that they drive Silicon Valley in the future. To that, we're committed to building equitable communities. One, where students are welcomed as they are. Two, areas of strength and areas of growth are known and supported so that adults can three, positively respond. Why? So that our students can experience the tasks and the assessments and the wonderful forms of instruction and the opportunities to, uh, that are born of this type of collaboration in these seminars so they can be strategic in their thinking, extend their thinking, and be full participants of Silicon Valley. So walk, walking around, I'm amazed that you all know each other. So thank you for, one, welcoming our fellows as they are. Uh, two, getting to know their strengths and areas of growth and helping them positively respond because they are now equipped with these units to bring about quality instruction and new experiences uh, for our students to reflect on their relationship with key issues of this day by informed, committed um, instructors who have benefited from, from all of your, your input and your shared vision of building equitable communities. And we really look forward to working with you all during these coming years. But honestly, over the last couple, three, or a couple days or so, we've also identified a tension. And the tension of how do we have this compact, rich, shared experience? And how does that affect a district or three districts of nearly 60,000 students, over 2,000 educators? So that if we talk about building equitable communities, it's not just points where equity is brought about in a classroom, but among our classrooms across our staff that we build that out. And so we are very interested um, as, as district leadership as well of working with all of you to figure out how do we bring the benefits of the YNI experience to scale to really impact all of our learners across all our districts. We welcome you in participation in that in the next couple of years. Thank you.